Welcome to this, the first video in the Renerex Studio Tracking UI Elements series, Track by Recording. We will use the demo app and record a click of the female RDB button. We begin by opening Renerex Studio and creating a new blank solution. Once named, we go to the recording module, the tab for which is already open. We click on record and the demo app appears, together with the Recorder Control Center. Ranarex Studio automatically tracks UI elements as you move between them. Here we move from the test database working environment through to the female RDB button. We click on the button and find that the mouse click has been added to the Recorder Control Center. We click Stop and are returned to the recording module. We see that the mouse click action has been added to the actions table and the button has been added as a repository item and the Renorix path or the path which identifies the position of the UI element in the AUT is detailed. It is worth noting that while recording Renorix Studio monitors user interactions with the UI and automatically tracks UI elements. When a user interaction occurs, Ranarex Studio identifies the targeted UI element and stores it as a repository item, which is a representation of the UI element. Usually, one repository item represents one UI element. Ranarex Studio recognizes when a UI element is used more than once and then reuses the corresponding repository item. In the next video in the Renorex Studio Tracking UI Elements series, we will use the track button.